welcome back guys welcome to another video of reviewing uh ghost hunt videos with me psychic medium phil cook part of spiritual crystal passion um so today so we're going to be looking at some videos obviously you can see there's new top five um i'm going to be going through some of his videos and obviously what's going on etc etc so let's see so obviously inside the home off. mad with grief the farmer took the lives of their two children while they slept in their beds and then he took his own life in the barn the unsettling tragic history has matt and andy a little creeped out so as they explore the I haven't building met these, but I've been told and that's many when good andy about these sees uh, they, they are quite funny on face as well. they are really funny this is just all a bit freaky let's go in the bathroom there's nothing let's in here oh Oh, no, nah, I don't know what I feel about this. Carpet. The first thing is... Very just spongy. Trust your very Tr spongy trust your carpet. In it, it's very soft. Oh, what? Oh, what? <laughs> what? Huh. What? You f***ed in there? Look, what? Oh, is this? <laughs> <laughs> Do it again, because I don't know if I've got it on camera. I don't know if you can see it. He can. Uh, See, we've, the funniest thing is that we've been freaked out by this before as well by like when we've done ghost hunts and stuff like that we've literally gone you know move your move the light and thinking what the hell is that black shadow there next you know it's like uh, a piece of bar hanging from the ceiling it could be a leaf in the woods or something like that you know it sounds sappy you think oh my god boy yeah you have to laugh at stuff like this like this because it's quite funny after Andy's absolutely terrifying encounter with a lamp cord, the two guys laugh it off and continue that, looking that around. Is quite funny. But not soon after, things take a truly creepy turn when they hear something absolutely unnerving coming from somewhere inside the building. Okay, so for me already, I don't like the energy. It feels very um, dense, heavy. Now I've had this on a ghost hunt that I did uh, in the uh, circle that I teach. We went live in that and we heard footsteps coming up into the building. Now we've had exactly the same as that and there was no one there. We turned all the lights off. Now this is a spirit to grab their attention to either try and scare them or to try and... Uh, get their attention to try and help that spirit. Sometimes they're trapped. Sometimes they need that release and that help them. And this is the thing when you go to abandoned houses. Obviously, you will make sure it's like safe. Down, but down the island, down there, this is downstairs. the fun thing about ghost hunting when this stuff happens. It's happening again. But they're right there. So... Can't you hear that? Can you hear voices, let alone... But at the same time, you gotta be careful. Like for me, this feels genuine because these guys are genuine. So look at that. So things have been moved, but you just gotta be careful if there's anybody with you. But that no, literally went flying past them by looks of him. Looks like a broom. Look at that. Looks like a broom's been chucked. Now I've been to ghost hunts and done ghost hunts. That stuff like this has happened. It has uh, flew across the room or flown across the room. Um, it's like blocking it off. And this is the thing. This is where spirits where's want to entrap you or uh, take your energy and stuff like that. So, you know, we even even like you know, ghosts and you got to be really no, careful of doing know. as well. They're not just to take no, take the mick. I don't because it weren't weren't balanced on here, were it? It couldn't happen. Just let me get here. But that was the thing, like though. He's, he's saying like there it was balanced and stuff. But the way it's come across and the way it's happened, it's, it's like I said, he's blocking him. So Matt for me, Andy, hear what that, like that is weird. That is downstairs. When they go back out into the hallway, an old broom is inexplicably thrown onto the staircase from somewhere. While trying to find an explanation for the terrifying event, a childlike voice can be heard whispering, "It's me." Don't like it, man. Don't like it, man. Yeah. 
And that's the Dodge thing. When, this is the thing. We get so engrossed so could it be and that so distracted that, captured at that spirit? moment in time, we get so distracted and we get so caught up in everything. Don't forget your emotions are running. You know, you're feeling the energy and everything like that. Really does massively affect you. And this is the thing that we, you know, when you do ghost hunts, you got to be wary of, especially you know, d d bad places that's got like you know a sad, a sad story. Like you said, you know, the woman. Uh, I think the woman killed it. Got killed by the gentleman or something like that. Um, but it, this is this is the thing. This is what's so scary, but so good at the same time of showing that we're not just the ones living in this universe. You can't destroy matter and energy. Maybe you know. Again, down to whatever you believe in. Um, but for me, spirits are definitely real, and this is another one that proved another video, good video of evidence of it as well. Um, and it's just fascinating fascinating we, we would never know a hundred percent i i know uh i've had close death experiences so I, i've seen parts of the other side but i gotta admit that regarding videos like this this is fascinating this is what you want to see this is what you want to happen on a ghost hunt and they they just go they ain't actually really ghost uh, hunters they investigate the areas like abandoned places but this is what you want and again you know do you believe this is real or do you believe it's fake? It's one of them. It's one of them. I genuinely believe that these guys are genuine and I believe that they are uh, experiencing a paranormal um, energy, voices, noises, and especially that as well. You know, the paranormal are just spirits that want to communicate either for good or for bad. Now, let me know in the comments below what you think of this video of Nuke's Top 5. Um, again, these guys are quite funny to watch on YouTube as well. Uh, so give a shout out to them as well. So yeah, so hopefully, hopefully we're going to review some more and see what we get. But if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and I'll catch you again very, very soon. So if you like these videos, guys, please hit over to our TikTok page. Uh, as you see, there is many, many different ones, uh, videos that we do daily as well. And also as well, if you like everything that you see as well, we also go live on Facebook doing free readings and trying to help out people for free as well. So please give us a like and a follow on that as well.